Good morning. Don't you think it's sort of cool when you understand that you were wrong about something? This happened to me this morning. It's about what's going on in the UK. I was so wrong about this, see. My idea, more or less, was something like this. People in the UK were very, very angry because of uncontrolled mass immigration. It's been going on for a long, long time. And many of these people who came to the UK, they don't even like the citizens of the UK. You know? And what you are doing, they don't like you. you know? And they want their own rules. And then bad things happen too. And this thing happened in Southport recently. Three little girls were killed. And that's why people are angry. You know, that was my idea. I was so wrong about this. And I want to share this with you. See, I read this article. I want to encourage you to join me on this trip. It's like a trip where you see this story develop on what really happened in the UK. All right. So it's a, an article written by Matthias Vog. He's a cultural writer in this Swedish newspaper, Aftonbladet. So here we go, all right? Hold on to your seats. This is what really happened in the UK, all right? So this is the headline. Fascists. <laughs> Fascists, Russia and Musk are driving the riots. That's right, that's the headline. He talks about Tommy Robinson. Tommy is back as the biggest influencer of the extreme right. And he talks about what happened in Southport. This ter terrible thing happens in the British city of Southport. A teenager attacks a dance class and stabs 11, 11 children, three of whom die. A teenager. It will be the spark that triggers a week of far-right riots, mainly directed at mosques and refugee centers. And then here comes Elon Musk. See? Yeah, you remember the headline? Fascists, Russia and Musk are driving the right. So here comes Elon. Uh, now the civil war begins, writes Elon Musk on X. And it's on X that it spreads. A whole machine of hatred is started in a few hours. And then Russia, too. A Russian disinformation site picks up a false tweet. Back to Tommy. Tommy Robinson is not there himself. He's lying on a beach in Cyprus, posting where around 30 new protest rallies are to be held. So he's like, he's, no, this is fantastic, isn't it? Tommy Robinson lying on the beach in Cyprus, like a conductor, like a fascist extreme right conductor, you know, telling people what to do in the UK. Wow. And then back to Musk, Elon Musk. Musk responds, amplifying his message to his 192 million followers. So, see, this is what happened. Isn't that amazing? Now, seriously, I think it's absolutely fa fascinating. This is like my new hobby now reading stuff from these left-wing guys, trying to get into their world, the way they think, you see. Yeah, I think it's fantastic. So now you know this is really what happened in the, in the UK. It's nothing to do with the citizens being angry. No, nothing. Ordinary citizens, people with common sense, People, you know, ordinary, normal people. It's nothing to do with them being angry. No, no, this is about fascists, Russia, and Elon Musk. 
There you go. You're welcome. Be good.